All right. Son. It's almost hard. <laughs> Son. After all those years of hard work, here we are. We've arrived. Look what you've made possible. Hello guys, and welcome back to some more Fallout 4. I just got a guy saying I look forward to working with your future People director. The surface have got it pretty bad. Makes me thankful for being down here. Oh, you're not gonna enjoy I that. It. I just executed two people. Our so lifelike, I keep mistaking them for real people. Enrico. Power demand jumped another 5% this year. Power? How about you just kind of chill for a little bit? <laughs> you guys are pushing the power too far. It's like today with the crappiest cars, they take way too much power for what they deliver. And then again, they do deliver a lot sometimes, but then again, you also lose a lot of power for that. So, you know, you can try to keep a balance. No one says you have to always outdo everyone. Especially in this universe where you have no competition, by the way, and yet you still outdo yourselves with power. So, uh, yeah, I brought the thing um, you want me to bring. Dr. Fillmore. I think that was enough excitement for, well, ever. Thank you, really. Couldn't have managed it without you. I'll make sure the agitator gets where it needs to go. I understand Father is anxious to get you involved in something else. You'd better not keep him waiting. Involved in something else? I would prefer to be extra careful. I, I'm already enemies with the Brotherhood of Steel, so... Nice work bringing that rogue synth back. No problem. Uh, how are things going? Do you require anything? No. But you guys should really do something soon, because I'm helping the Institute way too much. You're sticking to the regimen we agreed upon? Yes, Doctor. I'm taking all my little pills. Interesting. And even getting extra rest? Are there many more of these questions? Interesting. Any additional Interesting. <laughs> Not that I've Interesting. Noticed. I feel quite well. Interesting. Interesting. Feeling any fatigue? No more than I'd expect from a man of my age. I see. Interest. Oh, no, not not interesting. Agreed upon? Yes, doctor. I'm taking all my little pills. Interesting. <laughs> oh my god, could you stop now? Please <laughs> stop. Of these questions. I understand mass fusion was a success despite interference from the Brotherhood of Steel. Uh, yeah, I handled it. We handled them just fine. That's what Dr. Fillmore reported. I'm quite pleased at the results. Would have been a terrible setback to lose that technology to those savages. The Brotherhood's intervention must be placed in a larger context, however, given their penchant for hoarding technology. Future conflict with them is guaranteed. We are, after all, keepers of the most advanced technology in the Commonwealth, if not beyond. It also cannot go unnoticed that there were concerns within the Institute about your allegiances. I, of course, never doubted your commitment to our cause. Uh -huh. <laughs> but by directly confronting the Brotherhood, I think you've put some others at ease. I'm proud of you, regardless. The Thank you, Father Son. Future, and we must focus on the Son, Father. And look at me, rambling on like the old man I am. I'm wasting time. You're needed elsewhere at once. Uh, more reactor parts? Do you need more parts for the reactor i could have gotten them while i was out no this is a different matter hopefully one that does not put anyone at risk this situation i'm afraid is something of your creation however unintentional what happened what do you mean by that what's happened well while you were assisting dr fillmore a second team was sent out to invite someone from the commonwealth to join the institute apparently there was some miscommunication and this individual called for help, which arrived in the form of your Minutemen. My understanding is that no shots have been fired. I would like it to stay that way. I need you to go there and speak to your Minutemen gathered outside. Insist that they stand down at once. Dr. Thompson is on site, and he will be your primary contact. I know you can resolve this situation. But it is of paramount importance that this special individual be brought to the Institute immediately. What's special? Why all this effort? What's so special about this person? Mr. Wallace, despite a lack of formal training, our surveillance has shown he has incredible intellect. With his help, we may be able to drastically speed up work on the reactor. 
God, this is awful. This is this is getting worse and worse. I can't do everything. Uh, when are these freaking sets ready to rebel? When are you ready to rebel? <laughs> Soon, please. I don't have time for this. No one has time for this. Don't know I have any food for me. That's great. Okay. We are honored to welcome you here. Thank you. I will fast travel outside the institute because I am still allowed to do that. Because it doesn't have a requirement area, I think. I'll try to do it from in our up top side now, actually. Just to make it more immersive, I guess. Still, though, the Minutemen. What are they doing with the Minutemen? Come on, come on, come on. I do need to fix that situation. We can't have the Minutemen become hostile towards the Institute. That's going to compromise everything. Uh, I'll just throw this over here. Okay, we are going to... Wait, where am I going? How far do I have to work with father for you to, like, do something? Oh, well. Uh, let's see about... Wait, it's over there? In the Grey Garden? Mr. Wallace? Wait, what? Isn't it Wallace? Wait, Wallace is part of the... Isn't he dead? He's supposed to be dead. Hello there. What's going on here? You're an unexpected surprise. We could use the backup. These institute bastards aren't getting away. They'll have to go through us to get out of there. We don't know quite what we're up against, but it's good you're here to help. Uh, how did you hear about this? It's it's complicated. I'm not sure you know what's going on here. This situation is complicated. Oh, I know exactly what's going on. These assholes think they can kidnap whoever they want, whenever they want. Well, not today. Not while we're here. So, how do you want to play this? We thought about trying to lure them out here, since it'd be easier to kill them. But then we realized we probably ought to storm the place to make sure they can't disappear on us. That makes sense, right? So, you want to lead the charge? Citizen. What do you know about the person who lives here? Not too much. Wallace is his name. Kind of an egghead type, but real squirrely. Keeps to himself. We've checked in on him every now and then, but he didn't seem to want the company. So, we moving in or what? God, this is so complicated. Um, ho hold your ground. Stand down. No one is going to do anything. Tell your men to stand down. I don't... Are you kidding me? If we don't do something now, they're going to take that poor guy... Wherever it is they go, and we'll have failed. Again. Are you going to order the attack or not? It's a misunderstanding. This whole thing is just a misunderstanding. A misunderstanding. Can't wait to hear this. Explain to me how this is a misunderstanding. Work together. The Institute wants the same things you do. We can find a way to work together. I don't know about that, but... Look, if nothing else, you'd best get in there and make sure that man's okay. I'll make sure no one makes a move on him in the meantime. But, well, you'd better be right about this. Okay, that's more stuff fixed. Alright, let's go in here. God, this is... Keep, keeping the peace is getting harder and harder. H how come all the people are all of a sudden now when I'm a spy in the Institute? All of them are somehow finding ways to trap the Institute and fighting them. Before they were the boogeyman. N now they're just the enemy number one everyone wants to kill. Maybe it's my fault. <laughs> Maybe everyone is finally starting to take up arms against him because of what I've done. 
I managed to make them stand down, but you people better do something soon. Otherwise, this is not gonna work. Enrico. Oh, thank God you're here. I was starting to worry we might not make it out of this mess. You're safe. Everything's taken care of. You're safe. Good. Good. It was bad enough that Wallace started giving us trouble. But then he called in those savages. Doing what's right. The Minutemen were only doing what they felt was right. Well, from here it looked like they were out for blood. And if you hadn't arrived, I think they might have gotten it. Can we just get on with this, please? I know he's potentially important to Phase 3 and all, but I'm not sure it's worth putting ourselves in harm's way. It is worth it. If he's really important to the Institute, then it's worth it. <sighs> yeah, right, indeed. I suppose. I know they've been keeping an eye on him for years. Not sure how they originally found him, but probably don't want to know. But once they realized how smart he was and what an asset he could be for Phase 3, they watched pretty closely. I think they even fed him scientific material from time to time to see how good he was, you know, testing him to see if he was institute material. Let's just get Wallace and get out of here. Uh, can you tell me about Phase 3? What does this Wallace guy have to do with Phase 3? Wallace is, well, brilliant by all accounts. Like nothing we'd seen in the Commonwealth prior. He truly has a gift when it comes to theoretical physics. He'd be an asset to the Institute, specifically in getting the reactor running. With his help, we could accelerate the timetable immensely. There's just, well, there's a slight problem with that. He doesn't want to go with us. I was thinking, maybe you could try and talk to him. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll talk, I'll talk. No problem. I'm sure. All good, all good. Reason. I hope so. We really need him. Wallace, Wallace, come here, Wallace. Okay, I'm, I'm here to work with the Institute. I'm here to get them on the good side. Where, where is he? He's upstairs? Wait, where is he? Oh, he's in the room. <laughs> An accessible. Mr. Wallace, I'm here to talk to you. You're another one of, uh, of them, aren't you? Are you a robot? Please relax. Please try and relax. I know this is an unusual situation. No, you're here to kidnap me. That's what you people do, isn't it? If you even are people, I've heard all the stories. I know exactly what happens to people when the Institute shows up. Well, it's not happening to me. Calm down. Hey, just calm down, okay? I just want to talk to you. <sighs> fine, fine. What do you want from me? Uh, we need your help. The Institute needs your help, Mr. Wallace. It's as simple as that. My help? With... with what? The Institute has an engineering problem that your scientific expertise could help solve. In exchange for helping us out, you'd be granted access to the most advanced research facility imaginable. Whatever research you wanted to perform, anything, it's possible there. I promise. You'd be safe and secure in a way that's completely impossible anywhere else. A better world. You'd be helping us create a better world. That... That sounds good. Okay, fine. I'll go. Ah, <sighs> okay. I think we've got this under control now. Thanks. I mean, thanks for the assist. Uh, you're welcome. Hey, I'm here to help. You're welcome. I really mean it. I owe you one. I'll see you back in the Institute. Now this is going to be very complicated. Because you see, uh, I just dragged him into a death sentence. <laughs> oh boy. Speak to father. Okay. All right. Can I fast travel from inside? Considering that I teleport into the institute, it would, it would make sense, right? No. Okay. Then you cannot. Things are getting more and more complicated. You guys better stand hey down, there. okay? Yes. You hear me? Oh, nice gun, though. Hi. Huh? You guys are getting some nice, sweet guns. Good job with the hey, Minutemen, though. Hello there. Hopefully you guys won't murder anyone. Back to the Institute.
Oops. Please tell me now is the time. It must make you proud to see all that father has done, all that he has built. It's been a pleasure to meet you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But are, you, are you trying to kill me or something? <laughs> Doesn't seem like something you would say to someone who's like, yeah, we're gonna commit a revolution soon. A, a, a sin the revolution. Send the revolution. Hello, father. Sean. Son? Son, father? There you are. I cannot express how pleased I am. Our new guest is familiarizing himself with his surroundings. Yet he's already pointed out several inefficiencies in our methods. With his help, phase three will be ready in no time. And it's all thanks to you. Uh, how close are we? A lot of work went into this before I even arrived. Just how close are we? It shouldn't take long at all. The facilities division has it well in hand. There is one more part for you to play, and I think you might enjoy it. It is time to announce our presence to the Commonwealth, to request that they do not interfere with our plans. You should be the one to do it. Announcement? What kind of announcement are we talking about? A broadcast. An announcement to the Commonwealth that the Institute is not to be trifled with. As the so a threat. Director, that responsibility naturally falls to you. We've prepared some remarks for you to record. Once you're finished, we'll broadcast them to the entire Commonwealth. I will Please say it how I want to say it. And follow the script. It's quite simple. I'm sure you'll do fine, Father. But your father. <laughs> I'm sure you'll do fine, Father. Father. Now, I actually don't know if this is making me an enemy of the uh, the railroad. Uh, if it does, then I have certain issues and I don't like that. So but let's see what we can For do here. For years now, you have suspected that the Institute still exists. That we are among you. It is true. But it is not the whole truth. We're here. And we are. Your masters, that's great. Here to help. Here to help. Our superior technology represents the future of the Commonwealth. Today, we activate our nuclear reactor, ensuring that we will persevere long after the world above ground ceases to exist. Ensuring that mankind has a future. We have no desire to interfere in the unimportant details of your... Pointless struggles, daily lives, uh, personal freedoms. Personal freedoms. We simply insist that you do not interfere with institute operations. To do so would result in dire consequences, tragedy for all, unnecessary difficulties, your annihilation. <laughs> tragedy for all. Tragedy for all involved. Rest easy. Know that the future is. in safe hands in safe hands and that mankind will thrive under our guidance oh boy i hope that made people less hostile but we'll see son well that was interesting perhaps not what we originally intended but it will certainly get your point across now it's time to make sure that everyone hears it how would you feel about making a little trip to diamond city oh boy some fresh air, I guess. I could use some fresh air. A quaint phrase. Though I'm afraid the air there is anything but fresh. The radio station in Diamond City is listened to by many in the Commonwealth. If we'd like the people to hear what we have to say, it's the best way to reach them. Before we preempt their broadcast, we need to ensure it reaches the maximum range possible. I've been assured that the necessary parts are on site. You'll just need to install them to boost the broadcasting power. Report back when you're done. We should be ready by then. Please, uh, Railroad, when are you going to do something? When are you going to do... Can come on, do anything. Anything at all. I'm still forced to stay in the Institute doing the work, essentially. It's a little bit unimmersive that it teleports me down here. Father has done remarkable things. I would not exist were it not for him. Things are very complicated now. 
Like, it seems like I could change the institute for the better if I were the leader. But I don't know if their DNA or their... It's naturally too late for that. That's the thing. They succeeded in making a moral dilemma. Like, all the people down here are not bad. They do want to help out everyone. Maybe I can force them to help out everyone. But again, like, they might still rebel at some point or poison me or something. Not to mention how they treat since. They still want change. That could be causing some issues, but yeah, let's go to wait. Oh, let's go to Diamond City then, I guess. Uh, Diamond City. Been a little while since I've been there. When am I gonna be done working with Father? I'm just digging my grave deeper. Diamond City Market. And no one questions how I teleported here. <laughs> I was just fine with it. Okay, well, actually, can I sell some stuff to you? Like, I have a lot of drugs that I don't want. Diamond City Surplus, everything you need. Okay, so I need to talk to Travis, I think, and then have him broadcast everything. Wait, how do I... <laughs> Am I lost? When do you go around? Let's go around. Alright, Travis, this is going to be very complicated to do. Everything is kind of getting more and more tense now. It's it's kind of scary. <laughs> kind of spooky. I guess we are sort of building up to the finale. Uh, hey, Travis. Travis. Oh, hey. How are you? I'm, I'm good. You don't mind me like... No wonder it isn't broadcasting at full power. Radio thing with dials with buttons with tubes. Let's try this. Wait, so what am I supposed to do here? Reconfigure the transmit. Oh, so I can just kind of... Maybe this goes here? All right. In you go. Uh, thing with dials. Maybe I remove this thing here. Replace these two. Thing with dials. And you get thing with tubes. Oh, okay. Maybe this is with dials then? Dials. Aha. And then we have you with buttons. Hey, Travis. Hey, Travis. I haven't forgotten what you've done for me. Okay, cool. All right. Well, uh, that's great and all. Oh, and yeah. Water, water, water. You, you have water, right? Right, kiddo? You still work over here? Oh man, he doesn't even... He's not even here. Well, I'm gonna have to buy some water from someone else then. That also includes food. I guess I can drink this, but the thing is I might get sick. And get noodles. How many noodles can I buy from the, <laughs> the robot thing? You hear about the battle between the Brotherhood and Institute? Want a bunk of health? Yeah, I, I I remember that. I was I was part of that somehow actually. You wouldn't believe me. Wait, what? Hey, Where's Polly? Polly? I didn't ask for company. Leave. I don't even remember who you are, Polly. That's why I wanted to investigate. I'll buy all of them. <laughs> Robert's like, what? You bought all my noodles? How am I gonna make money now? That's for you to do and me to ignore. Okay. Let's see. Now we need to go back to father and tell him that we did the broadcast thing.
I'm feeling I'm, I'm feeling more and more like I'm going the institute what route. Here, that rogue synth at Libertalia was a real menace. Glad it's back where it belongs. It was indeed a real menace. Indeed, it was. Any day now, we'll have to escape this place. Any day now. All right, Institute, what do you want over here? What is all this stuff? Um, okay, I mean, it's tough for me to loot anyway. Although I don't want to want a cooking pan. What did clean room suit? Is this an anti-radiation thing? Nice. So, uh, what's happening here? Sean, enjoy your trip to the big city. It's done then? The transmitter has been modified. Uh, it's ready. Everything is in place. It's ready to go when we are. Good. Once the reactor is online, we'll cut into their broadcast. I'll let you do the honors. This, my friends, is the moment we've all worked towards. After all your effort, the time has finally come to start our reactor. No longer will we be forced to compromise to survive. No more will we need worry about outpacing our resources. My father and I couldn't be more proud of what you have helped us accomplish. And we look forward to achieving even greater things in the future. The Institute is now truly mankind's best hope. Thank you. All of you. So what do I do? I do this. Okay, I see. Can I leave? And then, then we close the door, I'm guessing. It's just this is close the door really fast. Yeah, 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 there we go. Someday, father. This will all be yours. Yeah, and uh reactor status. Uh, radiation levels inside reactor. Warning. Uh, initiate reactor startup sequence. All right. Son. It's almost hard. <laughs> Son. After all those years of hard work, here we are. We've arrived. Look what you've made possible. Uh, now what? Now that the reactor works. What's next for the institute? We'll get to that. There's more work to be done before the Institute's future is guaranteed. The Directorate has convened a meeting about how to proceed. I'm not going to attend. You should be there as Director. Well, uh, I, uh, I'm, okay. <laughs> all right. Sure. The guy who's gonna betray you is gonna get all the... I feel so bad. I feel very- I feel way worse than I'm supposed to for a video game. Imagine all the faith he's putting into you. Imagine everything he's doing for you and you're just gonna end up betraying him in the end. And everyone else is like positive and everything and now I sent a positive message to the commonwealth. Oh well, I see what happens. Now, if things go crazy, here's what I can do. If they say we should kill the railroad, I will proceed to kill them. Because nice the railroad is not bad people. They are not bad people. So let's attend the meeting and then uh, I guess we'll end the video afterwards. Give me some noodles. I am uh, here in place of my so-called director. I see that a lot of people are missing because I killed Our them all. So. First sent his first report. We're looking forward to Thanks for taking care of that. Okay, here we go. Um. So, uh, yes, I am. I am director Sagebo. Oh, uh, 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 what kind of work? What kind of work will we be doing exactly? Well, normally the directorate reviews and approves research tracts for the various divisions. 
Today, however, we're here for a different reason. Right now, we're all here because it's finally time to stand up for ourselves. Let's not be dramatic, Justin. There's nothing dramatic about it. We're in a position to push back, to assert ourselves here. That's what we've talked about all along. To bring you up to speed, obviously there are groups in the Commonwealth that stand in opposition to the Institute's goals. With the reactor now online, we have the ability to not only expand synth production, but to project power to a much greater degree. But we're only here to improve lives. I'm sure the reactor will improve everyone's life. It's a great accomplishment. Yes, but it's not just that. The Directorate has agreed that steps must be taken to ensure our safety in the long run. Let's just spit it out, shall we? The Directorate has decided that the Brotherhood of Steel need to be eliminated. As the incoming Director, we felt it important to inform you of the decision and get your thoughts on it. So, where do you stand? We should avoid conflict. I think the last thing the Institute needs now is to make things worse. We should be trying to avoid conflict, not starting it. I would love to see that big airship fly off over the horizon, but it's not going to happen. The conflict is already upon us. Unless we end it now, it's only going to get worse. We really don't have a choice. If we're to emerge from this the victors, we need to move quickly. As director, it's up to you and how we focus our efforts in achieving this goal. We'd like your input on what direction we should take. Do we increase synth production or focus on weapons development? Uh, that depends. What are the results going to be? What would the results of this choice be? I'd like to make a well-informed decision. Well, if we increase synth production, we'd be able to deploy more of them to the Commonwealth to aid in our operations. Weapon development would improve the weapons we have available to us now, making our synths more effective in the field. Which would you prefer we focus on? So if we're going to go with the one that is best for everyone, and the one that is less violent, then we should go with synth production. Because if we go with synth production... Uh, then they might also be able to help rebuild if that if I go with the Institute in the end that is by accident. So synth production. Synths are the Institute's greatest strength. The more we have, the better off we are. Well said. I'll see that the necessary steps are taken. Thank you very much for your time, sir. That's all we have for the moment. I believe Father wished to speak with you once our meeting concluded. Surplus power should translate to increased efficiency and productivity. Apologies. I have an urgent message from Z-114. Your quarters have flooded, sir. There is danger of extensive damage to your personal effects. Oh, details. Do you have any more details? Some of your prized possessions from the surface are in immediate peril. To avoid any undue tragedy, please see Z-114 at once. Everything is breaking loose now. Everything yeah, is going crazy. speaks highly of your combat skills. I uh, I barely know that unit. Apparently, I could have brought that with me as a companion, but I didn't even remember the, the a thing. Clean and healthy work environment is essential to maximum what do you want to speak about, Father? Another line. Oh, he wants to kill the the railroad. Ooh. We're gonna avoid talking to him. I guess that's all I can do right now. Is um. Just Do what as I you can. gave life to Father, he gave life to many of us. W where is he, by the way? I, I would like to speak with him, but I guess we'll finish all that in the next video because everything everything's breaking loose now. We're near the end of the game. Everything is starting to happen. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, consider liking and subscribing. Hope to see you in the next one. And as always, stay awesome.